welcome if you are new here or welcome back if you have been here before i am freya this is budgie budgets and it's monday minis it's monday minis with a twist you guys because we're gonna do monday minis first and then i have an exciting new binder what um <laughs> so i'm gonna put this over to the side this is our monday minis money so we've got 10 20 25 and 30 and hopefully we have 30 budgie bucks here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and 30. I just filmed my budget with me and I realized I forgot to mention, if you can see specks all over my fingernails, I don't know if you'll be able to see them or not, but I took those glitter bomb scratch offs off my Debt binder challenges. <laughs> oh my god, I can't get off my nails now. Glitter everywhere, and I've washed my hands so many times, and it, it's like properly stuck on there. Luckily, it doesn't look too bad because it just looks like I've put glitter on them. <laughs> but I can't believe it. It's like properly stuck. Okay, so let's get out our Monday minis. Um, now where are we gonna put these? So, think it actually. Um, my kids have decided that they're not too phased about Halloween. Um, they don't care that much. Um, so I'm not, it's, I'm keeping the haunted house tracker, but it's not going to go to Halloween. It'll either go to Christmas or to um, my girls, I've mentioned before, are so keen for a bunk bed. So I have made them their own little tracker. Um, it's little piggies and little elephants sleeping. So my oldest daughter has a little piggy toy. And my youngest is obsessed with elephants at the moment. So um, they want that to be part of their Christmas present. But obviously what I'm saving for them each for Christmas is not going to cover the cost of a giant bunk bed. Um, so, cause they want it to be a double down the bottom and a single up the top. So we'll need a new mattress as well. So I've got that tracker in there. That's probably where that money will go um, to kickstart that, I think. But we'll see how we go. Otherwise, it'll go towards Christmas. Okay, so let's do this. Uh, so we're going one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see if we can roll something that's not a five today. Oh, okay. <laughs> Who would have thunk it? Woo! Okay. Be good if everything got something when you're there. Oh, yay! I don't think I've had one yet where everyone hasn't got, whoops, at least a dollar. So that's nice. I haven't got my little helper with me today because all three of my kids are in the kitchen. Uh, my son is apparently making raisin bread and my Two daughters are making banana muffins for their school lunches. It's so exciting. So exciting now that my oldest is old enough um, to do some baking. She really enjoys it. Um, so it takes the pressure off me a little bit, which is always nice. Um, I will go out when I'm finished this and make some scrolls for their lunches as well the only problem is they all like different things when I make scrolls, which is kind of annoying and three whoops and five good old five and three and last one is going to three as well okay sorry I'm just checking I'm still filming all good I think I need to make space on my on my everything um, YouTubers, other people who do YouTube, YouTube videos, do you keep your videos or once they're uploaded, do you get rid of them? I'm not really sure what to do with them if I'm being honest, um, but they're taking up an awful lot of space. Okay, so this first one is a challenge from the Dramatic Panda. It was a freebie from her, from her channel. Oh my goodness, can't speak. It got one, two, three, four, and five today. Uh, so we will pop them aside and give it a five and that means we can color in whoops one pair this one just cracks me up so much i love a good pun 
and one lemon. I think I need to start deciding ahead of time what these challenges are going towards because I keep changing my mind. <laughs> Okay, this one now has in it five, 10, 12, 14 dollars. I might just swap those two fives over for that 10. Okay, so that's that one. Then we have Otterly Amazing, which is the kids. Now I think this only needed $3, 20, 30, 40, 42. Yeah, this one only needs three dollars to be finished. And it got exactly three dollars, so that is kind of awesome. So that 45, we we'll pop those over there. Um, what are we gonna do with this? I think I'll put this into school holidays. I'm just gonna steal those fives as well. That way we're not gonna have a problem with change. Okay, so we've finished Utterly Amazing. This one's by Prince by Carly Studio with 20, 30, 40, 45. Lovely, we'll pop this here for a minute. And let's find a new challenge, although we've got nothing to start it with. Um, hmm. I feel like I had a couple that I was thinking of using specifically for the kiddos. Oh, maybe we should do, maybe we should do not my gumdrop buttons. I still have to, I don't know why I put no problema in here because I still have to Clean it off. Whoops. Um, oh, maybe I should do that one. That's so pretty. Nah, let's do let's do not my gumdrop buttons. Let's make them all. Um, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. So if we make them, should we make them two and make it thirty. That'll be a nice quick challenge. Okay, so we'll start that one next week. This one's from my store, um, inspired by the little gingerbread man from Shrek. <laughs> it's like my favorite scene. Not my gum drop buttons. All right, save it. Uh, this is the one my daughter chose the Moolah Challenge from Prince by Carly Studio last week. So it's got one, two, three, four, five, and six. So we do two, four, Six in there. This one will save 50 in the end. I think we can swap our 10. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Beautiful. Here I was in a hurry to get rid of those $10 notes and it would have been fine. That's that one. Then we have our haunted house, which got four. So. We can do two little houses. Awesome. And can we change over? I think we can. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Lovely. So that one now has in it 20 and we need 10 more to save 30. Hang on, one, two, three, four, five. So I might just colour in this one because we're not going to count it because then we'll save 32 and there's no point. Because I don't use coins in my binders. Here we go. Whoops. Oh my goodness. Throwing things everywhere. Do I just stick my finger in that? I kind of sort of do. Oh well. Okay. Now, deck got one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Good haul. All right. Now, we didn't clean off anything last time because we need an extra one. So that will be one, five. And then we'll have one, two, three, four, five. And then we'll just have one left over. So we can get rid of those. And then I'll pull five out of the front of the binder and swap that other five. This one's nearly done. One more five. So we need four more dollars. 
Love that. Okay, so this has 20, 30, 45 in there. We'll leave that one. Whoops. Leave that one in front. I can't believe how much that glitter is sticking to my fingernails. My goodness. I'm so glad I found better ones to send out to you guys because not cool. All right, let's have a cuddle. We need five to finish this. So we've got one, two, three, four, and five. Well, how good's that? Okay, so uh, let me pull the other. Whoops, not that one. Oh, we've like used up most of our fives too. That's good. I was starting to run a bit low on budgie bucks in my stash. Two, three, four, and five. Okay, so 20, 25, 30, 35, and $40 in Let's Avocado. So that's for me and hubby. And I just stuck my finger in that Sharpie as well. And threw Budgie away. I'm sorry, Budgie. Okay. Uh, let's see. Shall we do maybe me, Skelly Love? Oh my goodness. I have too, too many too many challenges in here you guys i need to clean that one off so let's put that off to the side but then we'll really use that at some point uh, maybe i carried a watermelon because that's funny um i do like the doggies too <laughs> like saving it oh dear i should have said that one my husband loves a mcdonald's trip loves it uh, let us save this money. Oh, that's funny. Let's do that one. Okay. So this one is from Cashback Cute. She does. They're so pretty. Her. Oh gosh, I've even got more back here. Are these all my ones? I think they're probably mostly my free. Oh no, there's that one too. Oh, maybe I should do that one. Huh? <laughs> Oh, they save the same as well. That's funny. That's okay. I'll put that one in the front. I'll do that one next time. This one, and this one's from Custom Budgeting, which I just printed off today, but I haven't laminated it. Because um, I thought I might just use it as is. Okay, we're going to do Let Us Save This Money Challenge. This is by Cashback Cute. I don't know if you can see because I don't have my lights on, but it's beautifully foiled. This one's actually an oopsie one, but you wouldn't really know it. Um, okay, so one, two... Where's my other one? Three. Oh, there. Four, five, six. I got very confused then. Okay. Awesome. So we finished two and we're close to finishing two others, which is nice. Uh, okay. So let's have a cuddle. Is that in here? Beauty nails. Dates. Yes. Okay. So let's put that one in here. Woohoo. Um, so 20, 30, 40. If I need fives, I'm going to know where to come. So we will pop that in there. And that is nice to have. I'm not even going to bother coloring those in. It's nice to have a little boost in there. And then utterly amazing. The girls will kill me for not putting this towards their bunk bed. But you guys, it is school holidays so soon. Like it's so, so soon. Yeah, it's not the end of this coming week. It's the end of the week after. And I'm like, we do not have enough money set aside for school holidays okay and that one so school holidays now has in at 50 70 80 90 100 110 i am hoping we'll be able to go down to the beach uh which won't be expensive just petrol will be expensive but hopefully if the weather is nice okay all right, so that is all for Mini Mondays. And now, you guys, I have something else exciting to show you. Um, so this is going to be my new binder, which was my previous, but I doubled up that one. Um, I'm using these envelopes for now. I will replace them with my own envelopes when I have some time. <laughs> when I have some time to do them. So this is... Um, absolutely and incredibly and extensively inspired by Steph's on a budget who does her month ahead binder um and I was like do you know what that's a brilliant brilliant idea and I would like to get in on it so 
I have my emergency fund in the crystal binder. I'm going to be building that at the same time that I'm building this. I'm hoping to contribute $50 a month at minimum to both of them. Um, and then obviously savings challenges and things will go into them when they can. So I have chosen 10 categories. Mostly I basically chose anything that's a regular bill, um, that's a direct debit that I want to be a month ahead for. So obviously there are plenty of other things that I would like to be a month ahead for, but I just wanted to focus on the first 10. And then once we've done those, we'll obviously expand out to like more variable expenses like groceries, um, petrol, things like that. So these are our main family bills. Um, yeah, that we want to put money aside for. So first up will be home insurance. And I am going to do these like Steph does hers. So um, I will snowball them basically. Then we've got internet. Um, so how I've done the trackers too is, um, oh my God, mind blank. Sorry, you guys. How I've done the trackers is you can select your amount. So I've picked an amount obviously for each of them. They're all a bit different. Um, I've written the total up at the top on the back so I know what I'm aiming for and then down here you can tick off like how many months ahead you are so once I've done this I'm one month ahead and then I can clear it off and then once I've done it again I'm two months ahead and so on and so on um, I just I needed these ones to be cutesy and fun um, because I feel like if they're not cutesy and fun this is going to be boring uh, for me <laughs> like, it's not going to keep me entertained so we've got water um, so I will be listing these in my Etsy shop. They will go up hopefully next week. I'll let you know when they're up there. Um, phone recharge. And if you want any other categories, please let me know. Uh, and I can get them happening as well in this same month ahead style. Subscriptions. Um, so I'm putting these in in order of the amount that I want to save. So the smallest is at the front. The highest is at the back. Electricity. Um, and then I'm going to do exactly what um, Steph does on Steph's on a budget and snowball it backwards. So you'll see in a moment. So car expenses. So I've rolled both rego and insurance into the same, um, same tracker just because I wanted to keep it to 10 categories. And I just realized I think I've put 12 envelopes in here so I can take two of those out. Health insurance, which is one of our bigger monthly bills. Gonna get this one open. Gas, cute little thing. Yes, I did put cute kawaii faces on everything. <laughs> I was like, I couldn't help myself. I just thought it was so cute. And then rent. So that one's got like a little house. So cute. Okay, and then these ones I'm gonna take out because I'm not gonna use them for the time being. For some reason, in my head, I had 12. I think because I was doing my debt binder before that. All right, let me just make sure you guys can see what I'm doing and you can. Um, so these will be black markers. And what we're going to do is $50 every month, all in five. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and 50. And everyone's going to get a five um, until the front one is full. And then the next one will get 10 and so on and so forth. So we'll snowball it down. So this one's getting five. These ones are worth $2. Um, so this tracker is going to save us 55, it'll actually save us 56. I might cross that one off already so then I can remember that I don't need that extra one. All right, so $5 into home insurance. $5 into internet and these ones are all worth five and that will save us 105 by the end. Water is getting five, whoops. And these are worth three. So I just made them worth, yeah, whatever would make them equal as close to what we need per month. Some of them I've over, um, they'll be overfunded slightly, um, but that's fine. Phones is getting five. Descriptions. These ones are worth 10. Um, I did do little TVs, but this, uh, this also includes like Microsoft subscription, um, Woolies subscription, things that are not television related. Um, but it was just cute. <laughs> Electricity's getting five. 
Ink. This one's getting five, but each car is worth a 10, so we'll just do one. Same with, why do I zip these all shut when I put them in? Health insurance, they're worth a 10, so we'll just do one. Ranking them in autos I, was really eye-opening exercise. <laughs> like how much we're paying for different things um, and how much, um, yeah, like each one takes up out of our monthly budget is really, it's quite interesting. Um, like I kind of wouldn't have thought gas was more expensive than health insurance, but it definitely is. Um, same as I would have thought gas and electricity a bit closer to each other. Um, yeah, things like that. Um, not happy with how much we're spending on subscriptions either. Um, so rent, obviously these are going to be big ones. So each one of those worth 70. So we'll be waiting a while to mark off one of those, but that is fine. All cool. All right, you guys. So that is our first stuff in of our month ahead binder, which is pretty exciting. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'll aim to do this once a month. Um, and then I think what I'll do is the save it category in mini Mondays, I'll alternate. So each time I finish it, it'll either go in here or into our crystal binder emergency fund. I'll just alternate which one goes to which. Um, yeah. And that's how that will work. And then once we are making a bit of headway, or if I can put a little bit more money towards it, like $60 a month instead of 50, then I'll add two more categories, which will likely be, um, groceries and petrol or something along those lines. All right, that is all for me today. from me today. Thank you for sticking with me if you did. I hope you had a lovely weekend. Let me know how it was down below. Um, and I hope you have a beautiful week. I will see you on Wednesday for our regular cash stuffing. Um, and until then, if you can like, leave me a comment and definitely subscribe because I love having you guys follow along on this journey. It means so, so much to me. I am so absolutely grateful for each and every one of you. Um, on Wednesday, I will probably also have a chat about Christmas advent calendars because I want them listed up sooner rather than later. So I'm just getting the details sorted out. Um, and then, yeah, hopefully I will be able to have those up on Etsy by the end of this month. All right, you guys, have a beautiful week and I will see you on Wednesday. Okay, I love you. Bye-bye.